It's time for State Farm's presentation of BCQ, the Black College Quiz. Let's meet today's contestants. My name is Allison Sims. I'm from St. Louis, Missouri. I attend Russ College at Holly Springs, Mississippi. I am a junior, majoring in mass communications, broadcast journalism, and I want to give everybody a shout out at Russ. My name is Maya Bennett. I am a sophomore at the great Bethune-Cookman University. I am a history major, hailing from the sunny state of California. And first, I want to shout out my mom. I love you, mom. You're my backbone. You're my everything. The rest of my family, my dad, my brother, everyone in California, and everyone at Bethune-Cookman University. Go Wildcats. And now, here's your host, Nephew Tommy. What's up, everybody? Welcome to Black College Quiz, the game show where students from our nation's HBCUs compete to win prizes and scholarship money by showing us what they know about history, entertainment, politics, and much, much more. We're starting the first round of competition today with what we call the Talented 24. 24 students battling to be the BCQ champion. We've already met today's contestants, so let's kick the game off with the multiple choice round. Y'all ready? Yeah. Allison, you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. You sure? Yeah. All right, mine. Yeah, I'm ready. Yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> All right, make everybody proud. I know y'all want to represent your your, uh, your your college, right? Yeah. All right, let's get it cracking. Here we go. Literary lines for 25 points. To be young, gifted, and black is a fitting title for the autobiography of this pioneering playwright and author of A Raisin in the Sun. Mm, Maya. Who is? August Wilson. That is incorrect. Lorraine, who is Lorraine Hansberry? That's correct, absolutely right. <laughs> Civil rights notables, 25 points. Iconic activist Malcolm X experienced a reevaluation of race relations after traveling to this Mideast location. Maya. What is Mecca? Ab absolutely right, Mecca. <laughs> Television's leading ladies for 50 points. What is the profession of Gabrielle Union's character in the drama series, Being Mary Jane? Maya. Television journalist. Television journalist, absolutely right. Sports, NFL playmakers for 50 points. This fantasy football roster would be a squad of Super Bowl champions, except for one. Which one? Allison. David Tyree. That is incorrect. Colin Kaepernick. Colin Kaepernick, absolutely. Colin Kaepernick. Elected officials then and now for 75 points. The path towards Barack Obama's 2008 presidential victory began with winning what primary state? Maya. Iowa. Iowa, you're absolutely right. Here we go, HBCU student life, 75 points. The origin of the HBCU marching band sound came, can be found in this legendary black military musical unit. Maya. Harlem Hellfighters? Harlem Hellfighters, absolutely right. <laughs> Plays and playwrights, 100 points. Plays and playwrights, 100 points. This Pulitzer Prize winning Charles Fuller drama introduced the world to future star Denzel Washington, who also appeared in the film version. Allison. Soldier's Play? A Soldier's Play. Artists and their works, 125 points. What special technique did self-taught painter Horace Pippin utilize to develop his drawing skills? Maya. Using a hot poker on wood. Using a hot poker on wood. <laughs> Newsy names for 125 points. Newsy names, 125 points. Which of the following feminist critics dropped bars as the first female editor at hip-hop magazine, The Source? Allison. Dream Hampton. Dream Hampton, absolutely right. <laughs> All right. We have made it through our first round. So, Allison, right now, you have 250 points. 250 points. <laughs> Not bad at all. Not bad. Maya, you have 400 points right now, all right? <laughs> 250, 400 points, but we got a lot of game left, so get ready. Coming up next, we got the rapid fire round. Stay tuned. We'll be back with more BCQ. Stay in the know with everything BCQ. Follow us on Twitter and Instagram at BLK College Quiz. Then make sure you like us on Facebook at Black College Quiz. Join the conversation everywhere by using the hashtag Black College Quiz. This presentation of Black College Quiz is brought to you by State Farm. Find your agent at statefarm.com. 
and in part by McDonald's, deeply rooted in the community 365 days a year. Walmart, low prices every day on everything at Walmart. And Swiffer, give cleaning a new meaning. Welcome back to BCQ, the game show that educates our minds and supports HBCUs. So, let's keep the battle going with some rapid fire. First up is my girl, Allison. Allison, you all right? Mm -hmm. All right. Hey, before we get started, tell me the college. Russ College? Russ College. Where you located? Holly Springs, Mississippi. Mississippi. All right, all right, all right. What year of school you in? Junior. Junior year. What you majoring in? Mass communication. Mass communication. What you gonna do with that? Director. Director? Mm -hmm. Okay. Like film? Film. Television? Just film. Just film. Mm -hmm. All right. What kind of movies you want to put out there? Mm, I don't know. Something that's... I don't know. I haven't decided yet. You haven't yet. decided yet? But you like being behind the camera? Yeah. You started yet? You got your own camera and everything? Yes. All right. All right. You ready to get into the rapid fire round? Yes, sir. You sure? Mm -hmm. All right. Loosen up a little bit. <laughs> we'll do some exercise? Okay. Let's rotate them forward. <laughs> and rotate them backwards. You're going to be dancing in a minute, ain't you? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Here we go. Here we go. You got 60 seconds. You got seven questions. Okay. All right? You want to pass? Then say pass. We'll come back to it if we got time. Okay. All right? Start the clock. All about award-winning artists. All about award-winning artists. True or false? Jazzy Jeff and the Fresh Prince won the first rap Grammy. True. The Oscar-winning theme from Shaft was written by Curtis Mayfield or Isaac Hayes? Isaac Hayes. This award show gave seven statues to Marvin Sapp in one night. Stellar. True or false? Queen B. Beyonce has more Grammys than King of Pop, Michael Jackson. False. The jazz musician with the most Grammy wins is John Coltrane or Herbie Hancock? Herbie Hancock. What word did Lionel Richie shout at the American Music Awards? Outrageous. Name Beyonce's former Grammy Award-winning singing group. Destiny's Child. Got them all in, baby. We're gonna see how we did. All right? Not bad. We're gonna go that way. We're gonna bring over uh, Maya. Maya, stand right here. You ready to get it going? Yeah. You sure? Yes, I'm sure. Mm, got your little hat done and everything. Of course. Yeah. You have to look good. All right. All right. <laughs> look at you. Look at you. You think your mom and them watch? Yes, of huh? course. I told her. I said, you have to. My grandma, my mom, my dad, everybody. Everybody. You want to say hello to the family? Hi, mom. Hi, dad. Hi, everyone in California. Bethune Cookman. Go Wildcats. All right. Oh. <laughs> California, what part? Riverside. I'm like an hour out of LA. I rep for the IE, you know? I got to represent for huh? my city. The, the IE? Yeah. Inland Empire. Inland Empire. Riverside. Yeah. Okay. All right. What you majoring in? I'm a history major. History. What you going to do with that? Um, I actually plan to go to law school and become an entertainment lawyer. So. Entertainment lawyer. I could use one. Yeah. I got yeah, you. Because the one I have is terrible. Okay. I got you. You got me? Yeah. How long are you going to be before you get out, though? Uh, I have two more years, so and, and give me like six more years. Six, six more years. Yeah. My career would be almost... No, bad. you're still going to be good. I okay. promise. You sure? Yeah, All I right. got you. All right. You got me. All right, you got this rapid fire? You ready for it? Yes. All right, good. you already know how it's played, right? Yeah. All right, let's get on into it. Here we go. This... Clock is about to start. All about, uh, start the clock. How about that? All about award-winning artists. True or false? Jazzy Jeff and the Fresh Prince won the first rap Grammy. True. The Oscar-winning theme from Shaft was written by Curtis Mayfield or Isaac Hayes? Curtis Mayfield. This award show gave seven statues to Marvin Sapp in one night. Gospel Music Awards. True or false? Queen B. Beyonce has more Grammys than King of Pop, Michael Jackson. False. The jazz musician that won most Grammy wins is John Coltrane or Herbie Hancock? Herbie Hancock. What word did Lionel Richie shout at the American Music Awards? Pass. Name Beyonce's former Grammy Award-winning singing group. Destiny Child. What word did Lionel Richie shout at the American Music Awards? I won. Time is up. Time is up. That's all right. You think you did all right? Stay right there. All right. We're gonna bring Allison back out here. And we're gonna see how we did on here. Y'all ready, ladies? All right? Bethune, Russ. <laughs> okay, here we go. All about award-winning artists. Here it is. True or false? Jazzy Jeff and the Fresh Prince won the first rap Grammy. The answer is true. The Oscar-winning theme from Shaft was written by Curtis Mayfield or Isaac Hayes. The correct answer is Isaac Hayes. 
This award show gave seven statues to Marvin Sapp in one night. The correct answer, the Stella Awards. True or false, Queen B Beyonce has more Grammys than King of Pop Michael Jackson. The answer is true. Mm-hmm, y'all didn't know. <laughs> Bring the beat in. <laughs> the jazz musician, the jazz musician with the most Grammy wins is John Coltrane or Herbie Hancock. The correct answer, Herbie Hancock. What word did Lionel Richie shout at the American Music Awards? And it was outrageous! Outrageous was the word he shouted. Name Beyonce's former Grammy Award winning singing group and the answer, Destiny's Child. All right? Hmm, got quiet in here, huh? <laughs> All right, let's see how we did. Allison, you got six. Six out of seven. Not bad, not bad at all. <laughs> six out of seven. That brings your score up to now 550 points, all right? All right. Now, my girl mine, you got three. Three out of seven. That's not bad. <laughs> brings your score up to 550 points, all right? 550 for Allison and 550 for mine. It's tied up in here, Mm-hmm. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. You ready for the next one? Now, you know we're bringing your coaches into the mix next, right? Yeah. You, you got faith in them? Yeah. You got a good coach? Yeah, I do have a good you coach. You sure? How about you? I got a good coach. Got a good coach? Yeah, she said, I got a good coach, too. <laughs> yeah, all right, we'll see. When we come back, we will have what we call the name play round. Don't go anywhere. We'll be back. BCQ! State Farm's presentation of the Black College Quiz will return after these messages. Welcome back. It's time now for the name play round, the round where the students get a little help from their coaches. Hello, coach. How y'all doing? Doing great. All right, ladies first, you are? Winifred Johnson. Miss Winifred Johnson? Bethune Cookman. Bethune Cookman. Now, what do you do at the school? I teach history. You teach history. How long have you been there, Bethune? I've been there since 1989. Oh. All right. <laughs> Longer than most of my students have been alive. That's all right. That's <laughs> all right. I'm sure they love you to death. Thank you. You ready to have some fun? Yes, I am. All right, we're going to have some fun. You, 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 you're going to be able to throw out some good clues? Yes. All right, y'all been practicing? Yes. Okay, all right, all right. She's a good We're going to see. How about yourself, sir? You're from Rust you got College. Right. Yes. What's your name? A.J. Stovall. Mr. A.J. Stovall. What do you do at the school? Chair of the Division of Social Science and Professor of Political Science. Okay, okay. You got the Professor Sound, too. You got that. <laughs> okay. How long you been there? Um, since 1996. Since 96. Mm -hmm. All right, been teaching a lot of students. Yep. All right, all right. Y'all been practicing on this, this this little round we about to do? Trying to. All right. <laughs> <laughs> all right. We're going to see. Uh, up first, we have... Who we got up first? We're going first. It's you? Yeah. But Maya, Bethune. All right, let's go. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. You know your places. You know your position. George is actually right there. There we go, Maya. Yeah. Now, you know what your category is, don't you? Yes. All right. Teacher, you know what the category is? Mm -mm. <laughs> it's Andrew Young. Oh, him. Okay. Yeah, you know him? I've heard of him. You've heard of him. A couple times. A couple times. All right, all right. So if you guys are ready, you know you got 60 seconds. I'm getting ready to start the clock. You know that, don't you? Yes. Okay. You might have to mess your half during this round. Okay. Dr. Johnson, you ready? Yep. All right. You might have to loosen up. You got your hands folded now, but at the end of this, you're going to have to be. It's all coming up here. Okay. Focusing it up here. All right, 60 <laughs> seconds. Start the clock. Mayor of this city? Andrew Young. Uh, Atlanta. Oh. <laughs> Nickname? Um, First name? Drew. Mm. Um, mm. Give me something else. Uh, he's like the panda. Bear. No. Teddy bear? Next. Graduated from my alma mater. Howard University. All right. There we go. Marched with this iconic leader. Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Was a member of this organization under King. The Southern Council, the Southern Christian Leadership Council. Um, also was um, this type of representative for state of Georgia. Uh, he was a governor. Was Time is up. Time is up. <laughs> Have a seat over here. Andy is short for Andrew, baby. Andy. That's what she was trying to get you. Y'all go ahead and take y'all positions. Andy. 
It's okay. It's okay. See, the name Andrew, short is Andy. Or I Drew. Think Drew. Okay. Yeah. Oh, you are Drew? Yeah. Like Maya, Ma. Yeah. Yes. What I'm saying. <laughs> Start with the top. Don't go to the middle of the name. Don't just go to Drew. Start with Andy. Andy. <laughs> now, if you would have said, well, she ain't never watched Andy Griffith, so we would have no, just. See, yeah, yeah, I couldn't yeah, go there. Yeah, no. you thought about it, though, didn't you? Uh, yeah, it was just there. Just Am you know, Amos and. Oh, no, I wouldn't go in there. Okay. I wouldn't go in there. <laughs> All right. All right, Russ, we ready? I think so. Ooh! <laughs> I think so. I don't know. I, I really don't. Sense. That's why I think so. <laughs> I know. We're going to try. We ain't practiced as much as I <laughs> wanted to practice. Get your hands off your hips. All right, you, <laughs> <laughs> you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Professor, all right. You already know how it goes. Your category is Mary Church Terrell. Mary Church Terrell, all right? 60 seconds. Start the clock. Um, leading people. Can't say a word that's on the board. Oh, no. Okay. Yeah, you said, you said the last word. Keep going. Park. <clears throat> oh, Memphis. She has a park in oh. uh, Music. Um, um, singing. Uh, instruments. Piano? Place. Gospel? Place. Church? Um, institution? Mm. <coughs> Good clue. Um, in Ohio. Ohio. Uh, Ohio. Might want to pass. Might want to pass. Uh, oh, pass. I should have. Yeah. Oh. Voting. Uh, Time is up. Okay, okay, okay. Oberlin College? Yeah. Yeah, he was trying to get you Oberlin College. And what was the other one? I missed Voting it. suffrage. Oh, yeah. Civil rights leader. Yeah. And he said leading people, so you oh, lost that because okay. you said leading. a word that's, okay. that's actually in the title. Okay? okay? All right. Not bad, though. Not bad at all. We're going to see how we did. You all right, my y'all? Bethune? Yes. Okay, Bethune, good. Russ, y'all all right? Mm -hmm. All right, let's see how we did. Russ Couch, you got one correct. One answer correct, bringing your score to 600 points now. You got 600 points. <laughs> Bethune Cookman, you got four correct. Four correct, bringing your score up to 750 points. <laughs> 750. We got a little bit left, though. It is time now for the wager round. Students can choose to bid none, some, or all of their points on our final question. Today's wager round category is quotes. Quotes. All right, so students, grab your tablets. On the side of you there, grab your tablets. Begin uh, to get ready to write your wager down, whatever you want to wager, and we will reveal the question right after this break. This is BCQ. State Farm's presentation of the Black College Quiz will return after these messages. Stay in the know with everything BCQ. Follow us on Twitter and Instagram at BLK College Quiz. Then make sure you like us on Facebook at Black College Quiz. Join the conversation everywhere by using the hashtag Black College Quiz. Welcome back. The winner of this game will advance to the next round of competition, and they'll have a chance to continue to win more money and prizes. But right now, it's all about the wager round question. After I read it, students, you have 15 seconds to write down your answer. Here is the question. Quotes, Maya Angelou said, someday we will be able to measure the power of blank. Racism, love, women, words. Start the clock. Maya Angelou said, someday we will be able to measure the power of what? Racism, love, women, words. Time is up. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Allison, Maya. The question was, Maya Angelou said, someday we'll be able to measure the power of blank. The correct answer is words. Words. Someday we'll be able to measure the power of words. All right, let's see. Let's start over here with Allison. 
Allison, you got 600 points. How much did you wager? 50. 50, and you got it right. Words, all right. <laughs> Brings your score up to 650 points. You got 650 points. Let's go to Maya. Maya, you have 750 points, and you wagered nothing. And you put down love, which is incorrect, but you still have 750 points, which means <laughs> Maya is the winner. She is our BCQ winner, and you're advancing to the next round for a chance to win more money and prizes. Congratulations, but hang on. Allison says here at BCQ, no one leaves here empty-handed. We got some scholarship money for you as well, all right? Keep it up, keep it up. I'm your boy, Nephew Tommy, for Black College Quiz, BCQ. We will see you next time. This presentation of Black College Quiz has been brought to you by State Farm. Find your agent at statefarm.com and in part by McDonald's, deeply rooted in the community 365 days a year, and Walmart, low prices every day on everything at Walmart.